I'm a motherfucking train wreck. I don't want to be too much, but I don't want to miss your touch. And you don't seem to give up. So this is how I look now. I've looked like this for the past two weeks. I have not done my makeup. My hair is a mess and it's ugly and it's uneven and... My brows have not been maintained. I am growing a mustache and a beard. <laughs> kind of exaggerating, kind of not. Kind of definitely serious. I was making a TikTok the other day and I was holding my drink and I didn't recognize my hands. It looked a little bit manly. And I was scared because usually I really think that my hands are pretty. I think that I have very nice, soft hands. And so when I saw that, I was like, what the f who am I? I am in desperate need of a glow up. You do not want to see how badly I need to shave my legs right now. a little bit different here. I'm gonna put on a hair mask because my hair has been feeling really dry lately so I just kind of want to show it some love. I'm gonna put this hair mask on. I've used it like three or four times. It's pretty good. It smells really good and also it's vegan so I love that. So I'm just gonna lather this on my hair like so like that. Then I'm gonna take this scrunchie, tie my hair back in the messiest bun possible, and throw a shower cap on. I don't want to talk about it. You know what? I don't want to talk about it. I was going to continue on and do uh, a little bit more of this video wearing this ensemble here. But you know what? It's just too embarrassing. So I'll be back in 30 minutes. I'm back and I have wine. Mind your business. It's been 30 minutes. It's been like 40 minutes. It's been an hour. I'm going to take my hair out. It feels really smooth and soft as it should. Ooh, yes. I'm gonna give her a little rinse and I'll be back in three, two, one. My hair honestly feels really good. The curls are looking cute. I'm looking cute. This juice got me feeling cute. So I'm just gonna let my hair air dry while I continue glowing up. But there is a situation that I need to handle. And I like to call that situation my leg. Obviously I could have shaved them in the shower, it would have been much easier, less painful, but also less entertaining. So I'm gonna wax my legs. <laughs> yeah, I've never done this before. I've done it on other people. So here are the strips. I'm just gonna place them on my leg and pray for the best. Oh my god. Ooh, why did I do this? Yep. So I got ten strips right here, five on each leg, and there really is no going back now. I told you I was hairy, so don't even be in the comments like, eh, what the f And you know what? I'm not gonna apologize for having hairy legs, okay? Because this is natural. Would a man apologize for having hairy legs? No, they wouldn't. And that's on what? That's on feminism. Oh my god. Who f Oh my god. You know what? My legs do be feeling smooth, though. I'm gonna fuck around and do this every week. <laughs> Oh my god. Did I lie? Did I lie? Did, Did I, I fucking lie? lie? Wow. I feel like that was really like a bonding experience, you know? I feel so much closer to you now. Now that that's over, I thought that I would enjoy a little face mask because I deserve it. You know what? And you deserve it too. But this video is not about you, it's about me. So I got this in the mail today. I bought it off of Amazon. So I'm going into this with no prior thoughts or uh, opinions on it. Honestly, it's been so long since I've done a face mask like this and this feels amazing right now. If you're wondering why I didn't do my forehead, I never do my forehead when it comes to using new masks because one time I had a really, really bad experience. For some reason, I only broke out on my forehead. So 
not doing that again until I know how this works for me. Hey Google, set a timer for 10 minutes. All right, 10 minutes. And okay. that's starting now. So while I let this face mask sit for 10 minutes, I kind of just wanted to tweeze my brows because they are looking rough. So I went to Walmart the other day and I purchased this like press on nail kit and I'm just gonna try it out. But while we're here, how have you guys been? Let me know in the comments down below because if you're feeling like I'm feeling, then it's not that great. Honestly, can I just take a second? Can I just take a second to rant? Because I've been seeing a lot of people, okay, a lot of people going outside and going to parties and getting together with friends and going to visit family and it's like what are you doing we're still supposed to be social distancing because some of y'all are in these streets going to parties, going to see your friends. Like, I miss my friends, I miss my family, but do you see me going over to their house? Do you see me up in these streets partying? Do you see me going to freaking Susan's house? I don't even know Susan, but do you see me? No, you don't see me because I'm indoors, okay? I'm like this in my house and you can't see me. Ain't nobody can see me right now. I don't know, I guess I'm just frustrated because I feel like everyone is going outside and a lot of people are not following the rules and it's just it's annoying okay anyway so i picked out a nail that fits each finger and now i guess is the time to glue this baby on i'm gonna put some glue on the nail i'm gonna put some glue on my nail okay okay i'm gonna do the rest off camera because i feel like i really need to focus on this and then i'll come back to you when i need to start painting honestly not bad so we're gonna get into it my nails are done and honestly I could stop right here. I feel like a brand new woman, I feel great, but we're not done yet. We're so close to the end. All that really needs to be done now is to do my makeup, to do my hair, and then to change into an outfit. that I've kind of been dreading because I have a lion's mane. It is no joke, but I am excited because my friends over at Duval sent me a brand new hair straightener, which I'm so excited to try out. So this is what it looks like. It has kind of like snake print detail and I love the texture of this. I love the color of it. This cord right here has a 360 angle swivel to it. So like whenever you wanna like curl your hair with a straightener or if you're in like an awkward angle, the cord will always move with you, which I think is really convenient. The lowest setting is 140 and it goes up to as high as 450 degrees. I'm gonna link their website down in the description box so you guys can check out all of their tools. I know that they have a bunch of straighteners, they have curling wands, and I'm sure that they have something that you might like. If you guys are in the market for a new heat styling tool or facial cleansing brushes, I do have a code that they gave me. It's Alyssa Ray 2020 and you can save 70% off at checkout. So get that deal while it's hot. And I'm gonna stop talking and straighten my hair.
my hair is finished. Oh my god, I love the way it turned out. Honestly, I've never been able to get my hair this straight and this like flat with so little effort. I'm really, really amazed by it. And my hair feels so soft. So if you guys are interested in checking this bed boy out, this is the Duval Desire Series Styling Iron. I will leave the link to the website down below and also a link to where you can purchase this. Don't forget to use my code AlyssaRay2020 for 70% off at checkout. But with that being said, all that's left to do is change into an outfit. I don't want to change into anything too uncomfortable because I'm literally just going to be in my room or in the living room. <laughs> so I really don't see the need to like pop off on my outfit. But we'll see. We'll see. And I need to feel like me again, okay? Like, this bitch, I don't know who she is. Like, I'm sick of seeing this bitch in the mirror, okay? I want to see me, okay? I want to see Alyssa Ray, okay? I don't want to see this fucking ugly ass, fucking hairy ass bitch in the fucking mirror. This is the final look. I feel so good. I feel incredible. I feel like it's very clear to see the difference between the way I was feeling when I started this video and how I feel now. I just, I want to go outside, I want to see people, I want to like be social, but of course, I'm not going to do that. I have a date with my couch, my boyfriend, my dogs, and a whole lot of Netflix. So that's the end of this video. If you guys made it this far, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below for new videos every single week. As always, I love you guys very much, and I will see you on the next one. Bye!